Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or ALS, is an adult onset progressive and fatal neurodegenerative disorder affecting motor neurons, both in brain and in spinal cord. Despite the intense research effort, the pathway leading to specific motor neuron degeneration have not been fully identified, and currently there are no effective treatments for ALS. My name is Mariangela Morlando, I am an assistant professor at the University of Perugia and uh, I am a visiting professor at the Sapienza University of Rome. The main goal of my research is to find new therapeutic targets to tackle this devastating disease. In our laboratory we are interested in fast gene, which is mutated in the familiar form of ALS. In cells carrying fast mutation we observe the deregulation of specific circ RNAs and our hypothesis was that they might contribute to the disease. We started a collaboration with the MBL's Genome Editing and Embryology Facility in order to explore the most suitable strategy for deleting circ RNA in vivo. Hi, my name is Neil Humphreys and I run the Gene Editing and Embryology Facility here in Rome. The transgenic service we provide here is complete, um, i.e. from concept right through to the final product, which is a new transgenic mouse line. The majority of these projects are done for internal researchers um, based in EMBL. However, perhaps 15 to 20 percent are external researchers from institutes that are based predominantly in the member states of EMBL. CRISPR is the dominant form of uh, gene editing and we use this to make transgenic mice which support both translational and discovery research. The GIF developed a very fine strategy based on the CRISPR-Cas9 technology in order to delete the intronic sequence responsible for the formation of the circular RNA. The approach was very successful and we obtained the mouse model very quickly. We followed and tested the mice for one year and we observed a muscular impairment together with the loss of innervation at neuromuscular junctions. This is a very important result for us since it recapitulates one of the major hallmarks of the human ALS disease. Another major part of my role here is to uh, head up a team that develops new strategies and uh, technologies to make transgenic mice. And a good example of this is a collaboration between us and the viral facility we have here in Rome where we're using AAVs to develop new ways of introducing larger constructs into the genome of mice. It was a great opportunity to have such facility very close to my former lab in Rome. So we had the chance to visit the facility regularly to discuss the experimental plan and the results we were collecting over time. Our mouse model highlights a possible role of the circ RNA in ALS pathogenesis, thus suggesting they may represent a new potential targets for therapeutics.